Microorganisms are everywhere. They affect everything. In fact, they're essential to the functioning of our planet. We couldn't drink coffee or wine or even eat cheese without them. This understanding has given new life to the field of microbiology. And now, we can peer into the complex microbial world for answers to challenges in animal production. Microbial terroir is the cornerstone of Arm & Hammer's research and development program. The latest and most specific way to determine a farm's microbial challenges, the Microbial Terroir Platform analyzes, characterizes, and develops microbial solutions for animal ag, food quality, and safety. Terroir means a sense of place. It's the makeup of everything in the local environment that affects the characteristics of a product made there. Microbial terroir is used to describe the unique microbial communities in the GI tract of an animal that are impacted by the environment, feed, ingredients, water, and the animal itself. With our microbial terroir assessments, we can identify distinct microbial pathogens to improve health and efficiency. In dairy operations, the microbial terroir program identifies clostridia challenges specific to each operation and develops a microbial feed additive to control them. For large dairies, this is a customized proprietary targeted microbial solution that is continually updated based on our routine monitoring program. Here's how it works. Fecal samples serve as a proxy for the gastrointestinal tract and can be used to estimate the levels and types of clostridia in the GI tract of the cows. Feed and forage samples are collected to identify the potential sources of clostridia on the farm. Once at the lab, samples are plated on auger medium to count the clostridial population. Representative colonies from each sample are picked and the DNA is isolated to further confirm the identity and type of the clostridia. Multiplex PCR, a process to determine if the colony has certain unique genes that identify it as Clostridium perfringens or another Clostridia species, is conducted on the DNA of each colony. Understanding the diversity, or terroir, of the Clostridium perfringens is critical to developing an effective, targeted microbial solution. DNA from each colony identified as Clostridium perfringens is analyzed by a DNA fingerprinting method known as rapid PCR to determine the diversity of the Clostridium perfringens population. The DNA fingerprints are analyzed to determine which clostridial isolates are closely related. Isolates that are 75% or more related form a cluster in a tree diagram called a dendogram. Isolates are selected from each cluster to represent the overall diversity or terroir of Clostridium perfringens from a farm for inhibition testing. Clostridium perfringens isolates from each cluster are tested for inhibition with the supernatants of each commercial bacillus strain. The compiled inhibition of each Clostridia strain tested against each bacillus is used to make a heat map. The bacillus strains with the broadest inhibition are selected and used to formulate the Sertilis CP dairy product. After a few months, routine retesting is done to ensure the bacillus strains selected are working as well as they can. If new Clostridia are found, the product is reformulated to best serve the dairy's needs. Knowing exactly what challenges are present can help you be sure that the targeted microbial solutions in Sertilis are just what your animals need.